Hi, welcome to Wednesday Wisdom, a weekly vlog of inspiration from a variety of sources. I'm Reverend Karen Epps, Senior Minister at Unity of Pasadena in Pasadena, California. Today's selection comes to us actually from science and industry. It's the word calibrate. To calibrate is to fix, check, or correct the graduations of, by example, a measuring instrument. Before going into ministry, I worked in the corporate world in the manufacturing sector. Many times we would have someone come in to calibrate the instruments used in quality control and by the various machinists. The purpose of calibration is exactly this, to fix or to check or if need be correct. In a way, it's bringing it back into alignment so that it is perfectly situated with its measurements and readings. I started thinking about this as it relates to our bodies. Our bodies are an instrument of measurement. We use our physical senses to pick up signals from the world. And sometimes if we are not calibrated, the way we pick up those signals can be, oh, shall we say, maybe a little off. I thought I would share with you today a technique that is quite popular and people are aware of it, perhaps you've experienced it yourself. It's known as tapping. It's used for a variety of reasons to take care of different types of um, emotional discomfort or dis-ease, but I thought of it as a way of calibrating our body and bringing ourselves back into alignment with our higher self. And I would suggest that that could be the topic of your tapping is coming into alignment with your higher self. It's very simple. It's a combination of Chinese acupressure points with modern psychology. And you can do this at home. You can check out YouTube videos and follow along. But here we go. We begin by tapping the top of the head, the inner eyebrow, the side of the eye, under the eye, under the nose, under the chin, and then under the arm. Those are the points for tapping. So the top of the head, the inner eyebrow, the side of the eye, the under of the eye, under of the nose, the chin, and under the armpit. This simple technique can bring us back into alignment and allow us to recalibrate ourselves so that our instrument, our measuring and sensing of the world is in absolute perfect alignment. If you'd like to know more about us, you can find out, check out our website on unityofpasadena.org and have a blessed week. Namaste.